You've likely heard about Landspace, a Chinese private space company that recently made headlines. Their Zook-2 became the first methane-powered rocket to reach orbit, beating SpaceX's Starship to the punch. Recently, it set another record by becoming the first methane-powered rocket to successfully place a payload into orbit. Today, I'll delve into Landspace's upcoming rocket, prompting you to consider its resemblance to another rocket. Named the Zook-3 rocket, its initial reveal garnered significant attention, prompting speculation. Pause for a moment and share which rocket comes to your mind now. If you thought of a mirrored version of Falcon 9, you're not alone. Let's meticulously compare these two rockets frame by frame, highlighting their similarities and differences. Similar to Falcon 9, Zook-3 is designed to be partially reusable, allowing for the recovery of its first stage. One prominent likeness is the rocket's structure, a two-stage setup propelled by nine TQ-12B engines on the first stage, and one TQ-15B vacuum engine on the second stage. Additionally, it features four deployable landing legs akin to SpaceX's Falcon 9, which to me, bear an uncanny resemblance. Crucial for reusability, controlled descent is vital. SpaceX, a leading figure in the industry, utilizes grid fins on both Falcon 9 and Starship rockets for this purpose. The grid fins serve dual roles, control during re-entry as Falcon 9 descends through Earth's atmosphere. These fins adjust the rocket's center of pressure, enabling precise steering and guiding it to a specific landing spot. Stability and deceleration. The fins create drag, aiding in slowing down the rocket during re-entry, ensuring a stable and controlled landing, withstanding extreme heat and pressure. Remarkably, the four grid fins on the ZQ-3 resemble those on Falcon 9 further hinting at the admiration for SpaceX's rocket design. Even the satellites housed within the fairing bear a striking resemblance to Starlink satellites, not to mention the familiar paint job. If ZQ-3 were a child, Falcon 9 and Vulcan Centaur would be its parents. However, the primary distinctions lie in the fuel and building materials. Falcon 9 uses rocket-grade kerosene RP-1 and liquid oxygen, while ZQ-3 employs liquid methane and oxygen. There are other notable differences between the two rockets as highlighted below. The bottom line is this, while reusable rockets are impressive, imitation might not earn the same admiration. Theoretically, ZQ-3 appears more potent than Falcon 9, yet the latter boasts a proven track record within the industry. Landspace is gearing up for a hop test, reminiscent of Falcon's early grasshopper test. Let's eagerly anticipate and witness the trajectory of this rocket's future with its first test flight on site for 2025.